Hello Christmas my dear. Um, I am coming at you from the very beautiful shores of the Columbia River. Um, I have spent the day today in Washougal, Washington and Portland, Oregon and I thought it would be really fun to share it with you. So um, the following is um, uh, the day that I had down here. Um, if you notice any uh, strange kind of haze <laughs> or um, uh, just lighting weirdness about any of this video, um, know that it has actually been a 95, 97 I think degree day. It's very, it's very hot. Uh, I don't really function at 97 degrees. However, um, there is a huge uh, forest fire that's burning uh, just just up the river. Um, it started just in the last day or two. Um, the Oregonian or one of the papers around here that had a headline that was like, idiot with fireworks starts forest fire at Eagle Creek. Um, I think, you, wait, Eagle Creek? No, is that the polygamous city in Utah? Whatever, it's up the river a little ways and they had to like, I don't know, I don't know if they evacuated a whole town, but it was like a big deal. Anyway, um, it's like, what, 5 p.m. right now? And this is what the sun looks like. It's directly looking right at it. It's like a orange hot pink kind of situation, which is really rather off-putting. Anyway, despite all that, um, it's been a great day, so um, I want you to come along with me. Ah, good morning! <laughs> Hello, lady! Um, we are in beautiful downtown Washougal, Washington here, which is about 15 miles or so inland from Vancouver, just across the river from Portland. Um, I'm with my darling friend, Alex. Um, who we have known each other for 25 years, uh, fully 25 years, right? Yes, yeah, that's true. Um, and we're, uh, they have an amazing restaurant that's called Our Bar. Um, uh, Kevin made us coffee, it's Kevin is her husband, uh, made us coffee, it's incredible. I had a latte with ginger cardamom uh, syrup in it, made with coconut milk. I'm still working on it, it's amazing. <laughs> Oh my god, gorgeous coconut milk and everything. Look at that contrast. Look at that symmetry. Thanks, Kevin. <laughs> um, and now we're looking at some books. We're learning about de what? Decor fancy ducks? Decorative ducks? Fancy ducks. <laughs> this is an Indian runner. <laughs> Chocolate duck. Um, and I'm reading a cookbook. And life is grand. And there you have it. Cheers, cheers. <laughs> I'm gonna stand by a flower while I talk to you. Look at that nice flower. What a nice flower that is. Now, um, after spending some good time at the restaurant and good time at their house, um, we are about to travel into Portland proper, venture out from downtown uh, Washougal, Washington, um, and go to Portland. Things I have been promised. Um, we're going to go shopping for cookbooks, um, as I was reading this morning, which is wonderful. Um, and then we're also going to go to a plant store. Um, I have been promised that there is perhaps a guardian of the plant store that I'm going to like a lot. Um, and if it is what I think it is, I think that's probably true. Um, so, um, yeah, we're gonna just, okay, here's road trip, yay! <laughs> Hi, Alex. <laughs> Get in some gas. Get in some gas. And road trip, road trip. to Solaby for flowers and botanicals. Was, um, so we're here and plants and um, I found the ferocious guardian. Oh my god. Um, okay, this is Leia. She's so ferocious and we love her so much. Okay, next stop, video. we're going to we're going to beam an anchor, but it's Portland, so there's no way that they spell they sell beams or anchors. My guess is craft cocktails. What you got? Uh, beam and Anchor is a rustic showroom offering jewelry, kitchen supplies, furniture, bath goods, gifts, and vintage items. So naturally, yes. 
beam and anchor. And anchor. Great, let's do it. Well, would you look at that. <laughs> Mystery solved. Beam and anchor was a success. Um, and now we're hungry, I guess. Yeah, and kind of- I'm indecisive. We're indecisive. So we're gonna go to Hawthorne, the best place in Portland to be indecisive. New oh, trademark. <laughs> Hey, where are we? Good coffee. Hey, Alex. Yeah. What is that? Granola. Who made it? <laughs> yeah. I was promised plants. I was given plants in bounty, and I also received Leia as a bonus. Um, next, I was promised books. Um, we were going to go to the Big Pals downtown, but it's crowded downtown and like everything we need is here anyway. So we're on Hawthorne and we're just going to go to Home and Garden Pals. So um, here we are. Hooray. Right. I never know in a place like this whether I should be really excited or a little embarrassed because excited on the one hand because I really really love cookbooks and I like books about growing things and their whole like merchandise aesthetic is like right on par with what I like. Um, embarrassed because my tastes um, are basic enough to merit an entire offshoot store. <laughs> so um, there's that. But today I choose to be excited. Like this. Okay, fine. Maybe I did buy the Asian grandmother's cookbook and a Powell's t-shirt and some greeting cards. Judge away! <laughs> hey, dog. Hey. Have you had a good day? Mm-hmm. Indeed. Did you get things that you're happy with? Yes. I got sponges and a book about pickles and a mushroom puzzle. Nice! Yeah. Very cool. Mm -hmm. um, All things I needed. Yeah, <laughs> that's good. I'm pretty excited to figure out um, like some pad thai mm -hmm. or like some, I don't know, other other Asian grandmother food. <laughs> yeah, overall pretty dang good day in Portland, I think. Dang good. <laughs> yeah, it's been a really good day. Um, I think the moral of the story is that um, there's always the family that you're born with and the family that you choose. Um, and I have a lot of family that I have chosen down here in Portland and I feel lucky for that. Um, you too, Christmas, are um, family that I have chosen. And you used to be in Portland, but you're not anymore anyway. Um, uh, yeah, I want to come down here a little more often. It's good for me. Um, so I am going to pack it in with that before my person gets any more covered with burning forest uh, and I'm gonna head on up I-5. Um, I hope you've had a really lovely day. I really love sharing it with you. Hey, if you're not Charlotte Christmas um, and you like this video just take a second and hit the like button or hit subscribe or subscribe or wherever the that button is I have no idea um but do it because we like making these videos for you um and the more the merrier so there's that um Christmas we really should come up with a sign off you're right um I, I take vitamins drink milk I don't know um for today I guess like uh, roll on Columbia right and only you can prevent forest fires <laughs> don't be an idiot with fireworks okay bye Thank you.